awesome. This video is awesome. Sure. And today we're going to continue to another awesome video. And today's video is going to be Christmas related because you know it's Christmas time. So we're going to be doing a Christmas video. And this will be the only video because after dinner, so we'll be taking a break for a few weeks. Not necessarily for dinner. I still have videos coming. Christmas videos coming. So don't worry. But you guys are probably waiting for. We're excited about that too. It's been a rough year, but you know, we at least it has its ups and downs, but at least got through them every year. But the important thing now is now it's time to settle on Christmas. As you know, Christmas is the best time of the year, and you all you all are into presents and stuff, and you know, giving thanks to to your family for giving you all the stuff. And certainly to Sandra. And certainly out of all the Christmases I had, I could say that for the record. The year that had the best Christmas ever, for me, I will say last year so far. So far last year, have been one of the best Christmases ever. Because it was the year when I got the awesome stuff. Well, I got a book, Crayola, pencils, those, those normal things. Things I basically just want. And the next three things will surprise you. They're awesome things. And mostly, some of these, one of these, one of these things also, um, something that I had to get after some unfortunate occasion, but... Getting all these things, just, you know, it was a surprise. Well, first off, I got the laptop. Awesome. Unfortunately, after that whole ass I told you guys about, remember earlier this year, the first year this year, I told you about the hacker that actually hacked my laptop and ruined things for me? Yeah. That's why I got a new laptop. And it wasn't just the laptop. I also got a brand new TV. Surprisingly, I was not expecting this, but I ended up getting a brand new TV, which was really good. Not to mention that because the old TV was broken down. And the TV was actually a smart TV, so that was pretty awesome too. And the final thing I got was something, and again, I asked, I had this on my Christmas list. I didn't think I would get it, but I also got a recliner. And that was so good. And that pretty much categor categorized that Christmas. One of the best Christmases ever. Even though I didn't expect any of that stuff to come, but, but still, it did. And that's not the only thing that comes with Christmas. Also with Christmas, there are dreams. And like usually a couple weeks before Christmas, I sometimes have these weird dreams about something that's coming up or something that's like some hint of a present or something. Like I even had one couple, just several nights ago, I had this really, really weird one, and it was just unbelievable what happened in the dream. It was just so strange, so weird. And I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna tell you how this dream actually went. Well, the dream started out with me actually just being in bed, just laying down, and then my alarm mixing up. And of course, me in the dream didn't seem too happy about the alarm. So, in the dream, I just caught up and turned off the freaking alarm. But then. It didn't turn off. It just kept going and going. And then next thing you know, something, my dad comes through the door saying, oh look, there's Christmas presents in the in the room down the hall. And I just said, there was like, what? And he was like, he goes, I didn't get it. Because I walked down to the room. And when I got there, there were some things that I didn't expect to be there. First of all, in the dream, as I got out of bed, it was dark. But when I got to the room, the wind, somehow it was already like, eight o'clock or something in the morning and sitting right there in front of the window were, were a bunch of purple couches kind of strange and not only that there were also some, some like toys or something stay on the couch not something i would expect but i guess that's what i would think was in the dream or something and the final word i expect was the calendar for some reason the calendar read january 2019 and i was trying to figure out why why would the, would the dream symbolize that? And, and since then, I've been trying to figure out what that dream actually meant. Like, it showed Christmas and New Year's together. I still can't piece together why I actually had that dream, but I'm guessing it's probably something that might have, it's coming in the future. Like, something awesome is coming in the future. But, but then, after that dream, the dream just snapped me out after I tried to take a picture of the calendar, and next thing you know, it was reality. I pretty much thought that I wanted that thing to be real. I really wanted that thing to be real, but instead, it was just a dumb reality. But oh, at least I had a good time in the dream, though. 
But the big takeaway is I know for some for sure that something is coming. So I'll let you guys know if I do see anything. And also the final thing about Dream does also used to have I used to um back then when I was little I used to have a fear of Christmas trees for some reason. I don't know why, but I guess it was from having a dream one night about a Christmas tree. Like one night I remember I had this weird dream. I guess it was walking downstairs. Or it's Christmas tree, you just say, oh yeah, it's a nice Christmas tree. And then the Christmas tree grew arms or something. It was, as I, I remember, I think it was arms or something. And the thing just stared right at, and then it, it grew eyes and stared right at, at me. It was like, oh no, I'm screwed. That's what I thought at the time. And the next thing you know, in the dream, I think I, think, think I do remember myself, I mean, six year old self was probably a scream or something in the dream, but that's all I can remember. Because the rest of it was blank. I know some other stuff happened, but the rest of it to me was blank. Because that was just a six-year-old dream that I can't seem to remember. I remember half of it, not all of it. But they will show you that, you know, things things like that can get you. But now I'm not afraid of Christmas trees anymore. But just, you know, every now and then you get the feeling that, yeah, maybe something is going to happen to it. Something, egg or arms or something. But I wouldn't be I wouldn't be too afraid about it. Because if it does or anything, I wouldn't know what to do at the time. I do hope you guys, your guys' Christmas is fun and filled like mine's. Hopefully you guys can get some good presents and maybe even a brand new TV or something awesome like that. Have, have a, a Merry new, Christmas. Have a Merry Christmas. And see you guys next year. year. With True Stories in 2019. And that's it for today's awesome and amazing video. If you guys enjoyed today's awesome and amazing video, don't forget to be like and subscribe to always get notified next week when new videos from this awesome YouTube channel. And also, check out the awesome art I have up here. This is my art for the upcoming Christmas comics that we have coming out on December 21st. So don't forget to look for that. If you're a subscriber to the animation channel, so you might want to check this out. If you haven't been to the channel, then check out the comic playlist I read here. It's awesome. We'll see you guys in a new video next time. Don't worry, this is not the last video for me. There's more to come.